this is the energy vibration reading for um, the Aries Sun, Moon, and Rising Sun. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energies. I want to say to each and every person, um, thank you for the positive, positive situations um, that is coming out. Okay, in this quarter, this quarter begins June, uh, July, August, and September. July, August, and September. And this is the third quarter of the year 2018. So we are going to look in the squirtel to see what exactly is going on. You guys have the energy of the chariot and um, the empress, the chariot and the empress. And this is good because this is saying that a lot of you are going to be moving. A lot of you are going to be um, ordering tickets online to go on vacation. That sort of a thing It's going to be extremely, extremely positive in a lot of ways for you in your life this is a positive energy because you have the energy of the hurt which is bringing your materialistic needs but you're also having the energy of the um, chariot that is bringing you forward and, and bringing you out of um, situation oh my god this is really amazing because you both have the chariot um, in the month of July and the Empress in August and in September you have the energy of judgment this is this is amazing actually um, this is something that you don't see all the while, all the time um, that is a really really positive and amazing thing because not a lot of people um, that doesn't come up okay so here month of July a lot of movement a lot of people going up are going on vacation in the month of July this is a lot of movement a lot of traveling a lot of people going from places to places and that sort of a thing it's a positive month because you're going to be feeling happy because you're going on vacation if you're not going on vacation you're going to be changing house or you're going to be traveling okay so be aware of this as we move forward um, in the month of August a positive month for you guys even though it's the energy of the Empress it is helping you with your materialistic things and this is going to be wonderful okay so I'm seeing for a lot of people that you're changing houses you're moving houses um, you're receiving help materialistic help and that sort of a thing and it is in a very very positive way it's as if your life is starting to bring balance in your materialistic world I see the energy of judgment coming in whatever this energy of judgment is this energy of judgment is bringing information to you in the month of um, in a month of uh, September and this is wonderful because a lot of people haven't haven't been having anything in the month of the kid not not so positive energy in the month of September but you guys are okay let's see what is happening between the month of July and August um, the month of July and August you have four of cups um, some of you are going to be wishing that you did certain things differently but it's as if you have overcome a situation but you are wishing that you have done um, certain things differently whatever the situation is um, you know you wish that things were different and that certain things could have been different what I'm seeing is that some people are going to decide to move away to something that they feel much more comfortable in it's as if some people are going to decide to leave a relationship behind and um, decide to take another part in their life and you know have to make in that decision and you're all on your own you're gonna be sitting and thinking was that the right decision to make um, you know shouldn't you have just um, did something differently but the thing about it is that it is good when you can think about things and it's not that you rush in a, a situation and then um, the situation has become so um, outbound and that sort of a thing August into September is a wonderful time nine of um, 
Pentacles which is good so August into September you're going to be receiving uh, some um, your luck this could be um, what I'm receiving for a lot of people is that um, things are going to be starting for you um, it's good because the energy of judgment is here so it's bringing positive news to you and this positive news is coming up for you because it's coming up in a very positive way because what is going to happen and what is going to transpire is that you are going to be seeing that things are falling into place for you so sometimes we think that sometimes we have um, regrets and sometimes it's just your angels and guides are protecting you from a situation so um, um, when one door is closed another is always open and obviously um, this is what this is saying with the four of cups is as if a door is closed but another more, more beautiful door is about to open for you guys and here you have the king of sword so the energy of the king of sword is here so some of you could be dealing with a situation if your mother is a Taurus or a Capricorn and your father is a Aquarius Gemini or Libra there could be a situation where um, you are leaving home to go to college that sort of a thing where you know you are leaving what you know your parents and you're about to start out in a new world where you don't know these people and that sort of a thing but that's the only way you can build your character and um, some of you will be with missing your parents because obviously there is a young man or a young woman out there who is going to who's a little bit worried of leaving their parents behind and moving forward but you know that this is the best thing to do so you are going to be okay you are going to be okay there is nothing to worry about um, you're going to be okay there is nothing to worry about what is coming in is um, an energy of the page of cups some of you could be um, receiving um, um, if you're, you're you know if you're with someone who is who is an Aquarius Gemini or a Libra it's your father and it's as if he is losing his mind you know he's 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 going back to childhood whatever is happening he's going back to childhood he's obviously going back to childhood some of you are going to be receiving grandkids some of you wishes and dream about someone who is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra is going to be coming out there could be a situation that you have been dealing with with them and it's finally going to come out some of you could be getting a message from this person whether this person is some of you could be receiving a message from this person okay alrighty what is happening is I'm feeling a sort of a nostalgia I don't know what it is but I'm, I'm feeling a sort of nostalgia and this is coming up in the sense that there have been situation and things that has been happening to some of you the outcomes with the king of swords it could be your father that is about to make a transition in this period that means that this person whoever he is is about to make some transition um, could be going over but um, it could be that he's losing his mind and this is not a good message but um, it's a message that I have to give someone out there if your father is a if your father is an Aquarian a Gemini or a Libran um, 
he's he's going back to a baby stage. He's you know it's as if he's he's going back to a baby stage. Whatever is happening and whenever that is happening is Alzheimer. It can be Alzheimer or it can be that he is about to cross over because I'm seeing this. Um, some of you, your father could be um, receiving to hear um, that he is going to become a grandfather. That could be what that is um, playing out to. Okay, so it could be different um, things for different people. Um, let me know what is happening because I'm seeing this energy um, working here. So obviously there is something that is going on. Okay, alrighty. Okay, let's go and look at to see the general energies for all the different people. So we are first going to look at the general energy, then work and career, and then love. So for the ladies, 15 years to um, 40, general, you're going to start moving. It is a time where I'm seeing that all of you ladies start to look for a new study, look for other new things to do you're going to start moving you're going to start you're going to pick up your life you're going to pick up your life and start going you're going to pick up your life and you're going to think yeah nothing is going to stop me i'm going to be moving um on for the men um you are going to be thinking i need to find the right person in my life some of you are going to be wishing for a positive relationship some of you are going to be wishing and hoping for a new relationship okay um, some of you are really wanting to be in a new relationship for the women over 40 um, you have a battle you are battling there is a battle you're battling and this battle is as if everything in your life you're battling with okay and as we look at the men um, you are going to be connecting connecting in love this is really love you are going to be finding the right partner um, in your life this is the first time that this comes up you're going to be finding the right partner in your life okay let's see what's happening for work for the latest between the ages the princesses between the ages of 15 and uh, um, you are going to be um, in conflicts at your work huge conflicts at your work you ladies are going to be in some huge conflicts at your work let me see what is happening for you men at work between the ages of um, 15 and 40 you're going to be balancing out some situations there is obviously some in a little problem emotional problems that you guys need to balance out some of you could yeah you need to do that um, especially if you're looking for work or you're in um, conflicts with people this is what I'm seeing for you men for you women over 40 at work there is someone who is watching there is some of you um, are dealing with an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra woman disturbing woman she's very disturbing these ear people are so weird you know there's 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 seriously weird people I'm sorry but I'm trying to understand why is it that they think that they should be the one that is you know hammering as if they are justice don't do that for the men over the um, over the age of 40 you're going to be connecting with someone who is a um, a Taurus a Taurus man and you are going to be in a business contract with this man you're going to be connecting with this man in some business contract you know this is going to be really 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 strange these two men unbelievable 
then you have the king of swords so you ladies over the age of 40 um, no you ladies 15 to 40 you're going to be in conflict with a man that is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra I, I don't know it's, it's unbelievable you men between the ages of um, 15 and 40 you're going to receive a judgment call this judgment call is going to be coming for some of you is about relationships and for some of you is about your children so whatever is happening some of you men 15 to 40 um, you know it is a situation where um, a relationship and that sort of a thing is going to be on your mind relationship and that sort of a thing is going to be on your mind ladies over 40 what is happening in love for the the Aries lady over 40 Aries ladies over 40 what is going to be happening God have mercy <sighs> whatever the situation is I'm going to advise you ladies over 40 you have to deal with you're going to be in battle with someone with two women they are you're going to be in battle with two women it can be daughter mother and daughter or it is some friends or people around you I wouldn't want to be in your position because you're a fire and I know you can blaze these people but you know it's it's a battle that you have to battle with these two women it's unbelievable whatever is happening is a battle you have one at, at your work and you have the other one that has to deal with your personal life it's a battle that is going to be going on for you Aries with these um, air sign women Let's look and see what is coming out for the Aries man over 40 in love. Aha, uh -huh. your partner is leaving you. Whoever you decided to partner up with, some of you have um, a Stenbock, a, um, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man. Some of you Aries man had a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man in your corner. You were um, connected with this person. You were, um, and 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 he's gonna walk away and leave you because he realized that this is not the right business partner I want to be in. Um, this man, this man saw you. This man realized that you have done things that he doesn't want to get himself involved with. And he's going to be turning away and walking away from you okay this man realized that you are on the wrong side of the track and he's going to turn his back and walk away so you Aries men above the age of 40 um, whoever that is the earth sign that you have connected with and you had this wonderful wonderful situation where you thought it was a good business partner he's going to be leaving your life he's going to decide to break the contract that you both have he doesn't want to um, go further with you in the third quarter he's going to decide to hand whatever um, that business situation that you were dealing with he's going to decide to end it okay Alrighty, um, new love is going to be coming in. Some of you are going to be having grandkids are going to be coming in your life. Grandkids, grandchildren are going to be coming in your life. Some of you are going to be. I'm sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. Some of you are um are going to be um meeting someone new. Um, but I'm seeing newborn new love because you have the page of la a page of cups 
and you also have the ace of cups you have the page of cups and the ace of cups okay the page of cups and the ace of cups this is what you guys have and this is good because this is love this um, some of you could be connecting with your grandkids in this quarter which is beautiful because I'm seeing a lot of you men connecting with your grandkids this is wonderful I'm seeing new love coming in um, positive um, situation um, new love coming in and that sort of a thing I'm seeing this sort of a thing coming out and um, let's see what other message is there I choose to learn through love so this is going to be your motto for the third quarter so that is the month of July August and September I choose to learn through love whatever is happening you are going to be choosing to learn through love ladies and gentlemen please wait for your numbers let's look and see what's happening judgment is here so number 20 number 20 number 20 number 20 number 6 and number 20 number 6 and number 20 1 6 and 20 number 1 6 and 20 namaste until next time mm -hmm.